big and small, tall and short, fat and thin. Hey Starry, welcome to the circus. Wow, what a big tent. And can you imagine Starry? It is held down by these small nails. Big tent, small nails. Here we are inside the big tent. Just in time to see the clowns. Starry, have you noticed all the clowns look different? This clown in red is a big clown, while the clown in blue is a small clown. Aren't they funny, Starry? The big clown is wearing big shoes and the small clown is wearing small shoes. Big clown, small clown. Big shoes, small shoes. Now look at these two clowns holding hands. The one in green is a tall clown. While the one in yellow is a short clown. Tall clown and short clown. Oh, and these two clowns in spotted clothes are the most colourful of all. The fat clown is smiling. But why is the thin clown looking so sad? Because he is so thin. Fat clown, thin clown. Now let's do an activity together. Here are two pictures with a word below. You have to click on the correct picture that describes the word. Shall we begin? The first word is big. Now here is a big dog and a small dog. So we click on the big dog. Correct! Here are two umbrellas. Small. We have to click on the small umbrella. Right again. Now, two flowers. Big flower. Correct. Next, fish. Small fish. Excellent. You have learnt to compare big and small things. And now, let us spot the difference between tall and short by putting an X on the tall and a tick on the short. Tall tree, short tree. Tall giraffe, short giraffe. Tall lamp post. Short lamp post. That was fast, Starry. And now, one last activity to find out the difference between fat and thin. The moment you click on the right description, the picture will get colored. Shall we begin? Here are two policemen. You have to find the thin policeman. Right! 
thin policeman. Now, fat monkey. Right again. Finally, two rats. A fat rat and a thin rat. Fat rat. Excellent study. Wasn't it fun being able to compare big and small, tall and short and fat and thin? I'm sure it was.